This is all about a website called Odia Bibhava. We elaborate it as anything that relates to Odisha, Odia language, or translate it into or from Odia language. One of the interests that we developed is to document what has been written relating to science in Odia language. And naturally, we turn to the magazines. And whenever we got access to the magazines, we decided not to collect only the science article, but the whole magazine. And that is how the concept of digitization came into mind. So during that time, we found that Vasakoso is very, very rare. And uh, the only method of preservation is digitization. The ideal machine was too costly for us. And luckily, we found a SP scanner. It was transparent. What we did, we laid the book flat, put the scanner upside down on it, press and scan. Then uh, we didn't know about the useful software, scan teller, etc. Then Basically, it was a mechanical hard work. 300 pages a day, meaning 10,000 pages took us with all kind of processing, almost nine months. During that time, a proposal from Megan Prashar. They had a proposal that uh, to collect um, science articles which was published that time. That period was 1850 to 1950. By then we were already feeling the limits of our uh, scanner. It was slow, bulky. So we started experimenting with uh, camera based setup. Commercial setup were way too expensive. Around 2008 we succeeded using an ordinary point and shoot camera of Canon which had a remote shooting facility. We could uh, take time based photographs from a computer. So, so it, uh, we can say that our major digitization program started from there only. ओडिया विभाग को आज दिन रे देखिले 10000 रु अधिक बही 127 टाइटल रो पत्रिका 21 टी खबर कागज एगुडा देखला बळ को भारी उत्साह निश्चय लागे किंतु बहीटा पाइबा वा पत्रिका जे कोनसी मटेरियल पाइबाटा बहुत कष्ट अनेक समय रे गुंडो अवस्था हि जे छि बहुत पुरुणा बही वा पत्रिका जोटा मिलु छि गेटिंग कॉपीज फिजिकल कॉपीज इज अ प्रॉब्लम बट वंस वी गेट अ कॉपी with uh, low cost equipment and volunteer workforce, we still produce about 5,000 pages a week. It's continuing, but the major problem is the copyright because many people have uh, already died and their children, they are not at all interested in uh, preserving their own ancestors' books. Government is still uncooperative or even hostile. So, and if we start raising our voices, it <laughs> gets back to us.